I've got to say, I'm not a cannibal. I'll eat your ass. But rich people are looking tastier than ever because they're somehow flaunting their wealth in ways that are weirder than ever. So I'm sure by now you've heard about the NFT phenomenon, which is digital art that is going for millions and millions of dollars. Well, this has turned into one of the stupidest things I've ever seen. The Twitter CEO's first tweet ever sold as an NFT for millions of dollars. And one rich person decided to buy this because either they don't know how to take a screenshot or because they have so much money that they have no idea what to do with it. So it's getting out of control. Obscene wealth in America is too much. There's an entire Instagram and TikTok genre of rich people just flaunting their wealth. And uh, Kylie Jenner definitely is one of them. She's worth an estimated $900 million. That is more money than she will ever be able to spend in her life. If she were to live to be a thousand years old, there's no way she'd be able to get through all of that money, even as much as she splurges and flaunts her wealth. But she decided to um, advertise the GoFundMe of either a friend or an employee, someone who does her makeup, because he had a medical bill that was really high. A multi, multi-millionaire shared a GoFundMe and asked her fans to pitch in money when she could have funded it in its entirety like that. This is a real story. This is someone who's so tone deaf that she thought she would be more personable if she shared the GoFundMe of someone. Hey, look, I care about this person. Let's support them, everyone. You're missing the point. When you have that much money, you don't ask anyone for money ever under any circumstances. So as Kaleta Rahman of Newsweek explains, Kylie Jenner is facing backlash on social media after she asked fans to donate to a friend's GoFundMe campaign. The fundraising page was set up to help pay for the medical bills of makeup artist Samuel Rauda, who was injured in an accident on March 14th and has since undergone major surgery, according to the page. As of early Sunday, the page has amassed almost $100,000 in donations, exceeding its initial $60,000 target. Earlier this week, 23-year-old Jenner had taken to her Instagram stories to ask her fans to donate to Rauda's GoFundMe page. May God watch over you and protect you, makeup by Samuel, she wrote. Everyone take a moment to say a prayer for Sam, who got into an accident this past weekend, and swipe up to visit his family's GoFundMe. The reality television star and entrepreneur appears to have donated $5,000 to the page herself. It is not known if Jenner has made any private contribution to the medical bills. This is just, it's outrageous. Every single person who saw this should be offended that this almost billionaire would dare to ask her followers for their hard-earned cash. It shouldn't even be a question. They shouldn't have to make a GoFundMe if they know someone that wealthy. If you're that close to this individual, it shouldn't even be a question. $5,000, that's, that's like pennies to normal people for you. For someone with that much wealth. And furthermore, you're not even using this opportunity to d draw attention to a broader issue. The fact that this individual got in an accident and as a result, this care that they need, they have to spend money? They have to find the way to fund this? This also speaks to our broken healthcare system. If you weren't so out of touch and tone deaf, you would speak to that. You would speak to the need of Medicare for All. But I'm sure that she's never even heard of Medicare for All or single payer or knows about it at all. I'm sure she's never even thought once about healthcare because no matter what happens to her, she's covered in her life. It could be of her fault or not of her fault. She will be fine. She's never going to go bankrupt. She's never going to have a medical emergency that she has to do a GoFundMe for to fund. This is someone who is so rich that as this tweet from Sophie Ross points out, she purchased a three million dollar car and for her birthday she decided to rent a yacht the size of a football field and she even spent three hundred thousand dollars on a fucking purse i repeat three hundred thousand dollars on a purse and i had to look up what that was birkins i didn't realize that they were selling purses that were as much as houses multiple houses depending on the state that you're living in so rich people are so rich that they're inventing new things for themselves to buy. Luxury purses, the cost of houses, digital art, screenshots, effectively. 
for millions of dollars. This is what happens in a late stage capitalist society. When you're so rich and you have so much money, you have to invent new stupid things to spend your money on. This is why folks like Kylie Jenner should not have that much wealth. If you can afford a $3 million car or a $300,000 purse, then there shouldn't be a single mouth in America that is not fed. I'm sorry, but until homelessness has been eradicated, poverty has been eliminated around the globe, nobody should be able to spend $3 million on a car or $300,000 on a purse and then have the nerve to put out a GoFundMe for her friend. Just fund it yourself, you absolute ghoul. So this is why I say the rich are basically begging people to eat them at this point. When we say eat the rich, this is why. Because they're flaunting their wealth in ways that is going to make the peasants rise up and eat them. Because guess what? When poor people are eating crumbs and they're so hungry that they can't eat anything else and rich people are taking everything away from them, they won't have anything left to eat but rich people. So this is outrageous and it makes my blood boil and it should make everyone's blood boil to see this rich asshole beg her own fans for money when she can easily fund it without question immediately and it's entirely just disgusting.